Hello everyone, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Thanks for joining my channel Cloud and Coffee with Dabrit. In this video, we are going to learn about how you can able to use Amazon Bedrock for the uh, for the um, for the embedding or we call it vector embedding. So why the embedding is more important in the very first place itself. So embedding is being used in the similarity search um, and uh, but if you are not aware what the similarity search is, similarity search is able to uh, use the uh, use your word and provide the context, uh, and so it use the context of your word and able to provide you provide you the result. For for instance, earlier we used to have this keyword search, so in every text it used to look for the keyword and then based on the uh, you know uh, based on the how many times the keyword will appear within within the text it used to provide you a uh, pro provide you result whereas when we talk about the sem uh, semantic search we will be looking to see if if the content are are similar in nature and then it will be able to provide you be better result so that's well, that's why like the embedding is being used so let's understand what the embedding is all about so embedding captured the meaning of a piece of a text in a series of number called vector and that's why we also call it vector embedding and we can use this vector to determine how similar those words are uh, uh, and try to each other so as as i said like it's going to win uh um, is going to be an empirical representation of your word and the uh, based on the weightage it will get each word the waste uh, like you know each piece of text the weightage it will get it will tell you uh the similarity between it so if it's if it's uh, let's say if some text is one other text is also near 0 0.9 0 0.9 uh, 9 so it means the one and nine nine are are in nearby so it may be this they are similar in in nature if they are having very far in distance uh, then they are not uh, they are not uh, they are not uh, similar in nature okay so let's let's go and get started so again, uh, uh, we will be starting this uh, mm, this Python functions here. So I will be going and uh, and imp imp oh my bad, sorry. I will be going and importing this bunch of a bunch of libraries. And once done, I will be going and creating these functions for for us to perform the embedding, right? So we will be creating and we will be defining those functions. We will be getting this get embedding. So we are looking to get the text. We are making a cloud. Uh, we are make, creating this uh, runtime session for the Amazon Bedrock. We will be invoking the model here. We are using the Amazon Title Text Embedding model. So you can use any other embedding model as well. But we are here. Here we are using that uh, Titan. Um, uh, Amazon Titan embedding embedding model. Uh, thereafter, we are looking to create two more uh, classes. We will be creating this embed item and uh, comparison results. So this way, we able to tell you whether the results are similar or the results are not similar um, similar in in nature. Thereafter, we will be looking to use uh, cosine uh, similarity. So there are different ways for you to perform the uh, similarity one is most popular is is being used is cosine similarity. So we are performing this this calculation here if you want to understand how this formula works even i don't know how this formula works so you can go and look into the wiki and see how this formula works right here we're just looking to learn how you can able to use this cosine similarity and how you can able to build it so the, here we are building the uh, building the mm, here we are getting the our item we will be opening it we will be kind of splitting those into line and then each, we will be kind of embedding each line uh, here so that's done and once we are here we will be looking to compare it and see if those those texts are matching or not matching this this for, for us to get an output of, of this one here once done now we will be done and save the file so we have saved the file let's go and uh, and perform let's go and run it having said that uh, as i'm mentioning again uh, this is this is a part of uh, working with amazon petrock lab uh, and i will be pasting that i will be pasting the mm, uh, link of the lab so this way if you're able to follow along and build your own uh, own uh, you know co sample code uh, this is just for for you an example and tell you like okay what all capabilities what all uh, things is possible with using using amazon bedrock okay so uh, let's see here we will be comparing the result so if you see here the cat dog mice so these are one so this is more like a uh, similar than we are having this one uh, this is different little little different however it is more like a rodent token still in a similar however if i go and look this one here it's a totally different uh what we are what we are having uh in this one and similarly if i go here uh mm, I need a direction to the uh, to a 
bread shop. I needed a direction to the bread shop. So this is the nearest uh, which is providing. That's the next second nearest is can you please tell me how me how to get to the bakery. This is again uh, nearest but it's not as near as, as, as the result is. But just to give you an idea right and similarly if I go and close this match for the cat, dog and mice this is what and then other again again is the nearest is this uh, rodent etc. And uh, there are similarly we would be doing a lot of, lot of search. So mm, you're able to go and compare it. But the whole idea can you please tell me how to get to the bakery. So can you tell me how to get the bakery. The first one I need a direction to the bread shop is a different one. So this is interesting. Uh, and again like if you look here like and lion tigers bears are not at all matching same goes with this one. So their with their value is very very less as compared to what we are having the, which the exact match right so hope, hope, hopefully you got an idea what this embedding is all about and how this can help you in the semantic search uh, thank you very much see you in the next video bye